Right, yeah, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to reinstall or re-enable the Windows Media Player 12 back into the taskbar when you're playing videos. Now this has been disabled in Windows 7 for some reason, it doesn't work anymore, but there is a little uh, hack out there that you can use to get this working again. First of all you need to get the uh, DLL file for the 32-bit or 64-bit version that you're using and uh, get that from Vista and incorporate it into Windows 7. Okay, now we'll put the link for these uh, files in my description there. So the first thing we need to do really um, is go to my computer programs and then media player and we need to put a file in here as you can see I've already got a file in there but you won't be able to incorporate this file because you need to turn off a certain service so what we're going to do first is go services like so click on that open this box up come all the way down the bottom and we're looking for Windows Media Player Network Sharing okay I'll open this up so you can see where it is it's this one we're looking for okay now you can see it's started let's just pull that and what we're going to do is right click and stop once that's stopped that was that will allow us to actually incorporate the file into there so I'm just going to quickly right click and copy as you can see I've already done this but I'll do it again just to show you go into Windows Media Player go into this space over here and just paste it now you won't see that it will just go in but I'm just going to copy and paste it in there now this isn't for everyone obviously uh, some people might not like the look of it down the bottom but if you do want to do it then by all means this video is for you so once we've done that we need to enter a code and this code you'll need to enter is this code okay register 32 and this is the you can either do this in the run bar or you can do it in command prompt and what we're going to do is go cmd right click on there administrator we're going to paste that in there like so okay now we'll put that in there description there so you can just copy and paste it straight in like that rather than you type it out push enter and this box will pop up click OK we can now go back to our services which is here and we can now restart that ok so just restart that up as you can see it's started again one last thing to do is enable it in the taskbar so the first thing we want to do is open up Windows Media Player and then put that into the taskbar by pushing this little arrow, this little line there, and that keeps it in there. That's important for it to work, otherwise it won't work. Okay. Right click on the uh, taskbar there, go tools or toolbar, and then put the tick in. Say yes to that, and there you go. It adds it down the bottom there. Okay. It's as simple as that, and then you can play your videos and whatever from that location. Okay. So hope this video has been some use. Yep. My name is Brian from brightech.co.uk. If you enjoy these videos, please remember, hit the subscribe button guys, favourite the videos, and also give it a thumbs up. Okay, thanks a lot again guys for your support, bye for now.